Hello there everybody thanks for tuning in to another video here on Armor of God. I don't want to sound like a broken record but I have to say thank you so much for your support and thanks for taking the time to watch my videos. If you have any suggestion or willing to provide any feedback feel free to leave them in the comments down below. So in this video I'll be sharing with you what Father Vincent Lampert said about our guardian angels and for me personally, what Father Lampert said about our guardian angels is very comforting and empowering. I hope the same is true for you as well. Angels are those who united their will with the will of God and so they are his messengers. The nature of an angel is spirit but their character is as a messenger where we get the name angel itself because the message they deliver is not of their own, but it's the message that's coming from God. And do you know why angels are often depicted with wings and arts? Well, the answer is, it shows their readiness to implement the will of God. Whatever God wants, they're ready to do it in an instant. Our guardian angels are very powerful as well. People should always realize that our guardian angels are more powerful than the devil himself. Now, we believe that before the fall, the devil was the greatest of all the angelic creatures closest to the throne of God, Lucifer, meaning light bearer. But after his rebellion, he's cast down with one third of the angels. Mm -hmm. But an angel that fell from a higher <laughs> ranking is inferior to an angel from a lower ranking who truly was obedient to God. So we think of the nine choirs of angels, you know, the the seraphim, the cherubim, the thrones, the virtues, the dominations, the powers, the principalities, the archangels, the angels. So our guardian angels come from the ninth choir. But again, our guardian angel from the ninth choir, because it's a good angel, is more powerful than the devil himself, who fell from the highest reaches of heaven because of his uh, rebellion against God. He is an inferior and imperfect creature.